love when we get a direct question. Is it likely ILS closes on the Florida acquisition and the astronomical European acquisition before the end of Q4? Very direct. Florida, yes. Other acquisitions, yes. Uh, the European deal is a difficult one to answer. I can say that there'll be two phases to the European deal. It's a obviously a huge deal. There's a lot of politicians involved and that's that's why it takes time. And that's why Nick has, has been over there so many times, why he's over there right now uh, with actually a whole team of people. Uh, it's not just him. The company we're taking over manufactures fire vehicles and military vehicles. And that's important to note because that means that we're dealing with multiple government departments, the Ministry of Defense, the Ministry of Finance. There's also state, state secrets involved. And obviously that will amount to some delays, not delays, but just the whole process takes time. There's just so many working parts involved in the deal. Uh, there's over 1,500 staff on the current payroll. And that acquisition is so large that that the, the actual manufacturing facility sustains an entire European town. So, yeah, as I said, two phases, there'll be an interim part to the deal, which we should be able to announce somewhere in November, and that will involve our ear up to manufacturing and the manufacturing of some of our current firefighting vehicles. The larger portion of the deal, not that the first part of it is gonna be small by any means, but the larger portion of the deal will take a bit longer. Bear in mind, you know, all those working parts that I've already mentioned. So that's second part of it's probably timeframes. I mean, it'll, it'll be early next year, uh, the second the second part of the deal. The, just also to mention, this acquisition is not the nine figure revenue acquisition that we've mentioned previously. Um, so that's important. It's also not, linked to milk holdings or, or anything like that, because there's been some speculation about that. That's a separate uh, deal that's going on. And it's why, one of the reasons why we talk about we're working on multiple large deals. The EU deal is just one. And um, yeah, I think that's pretty much all I can, can say on that one. Thank you. I think it helps to understand that the two phases just to give people uh, extra information as to why that's not that's not completed yet.